government, I should say federal government, is in a bit of a turmoil, especially in Washington, because they are, have, in essence, they have been uh, shut down for a time. And uh, many of the ones that are in, uh, in offices are somewhat panicking in a way because they have never been in this situation, especially in t as intense as, as it is. And uh, pressure is being brought down on them to uh, get their acts in order, and get the ducks in order, as you term it. And uh, so they have simply been given uh, what you call an ultimatum to get it right, to get it going properly, or to step down. Either way, uh, whatever comes first. Anyway, and um, so when it comes to Trump, Trump is what you call in a holding pattern, if you will, uh, what you call your his uh, Trump's emergency text alert system is on standby or being you know uh, put or put off temporarily, but it is about to be announced, and of course that is going to be a wondrous uh, thing indeed. All U.S. military bases are on high alert, not in a military manner, but on uh, observation for those that are going onto their uh, on their ground is the necessity of of uh, in of preparation well it's quite simple would you rather have be in preparation or not and uh, of course the answer to that is yes you would and uh, also you know put your that is uh, a bit of uh, info for you. And um, <laughs> um, uplifting info, if you will. Um, so, so the final preparations are also, you know, being made at this time uh, throughout the uh, beginning now and throughout the, uh, the weekend. So there are many uh, which you call cabal minions that are running scared uh, because they have been sought out, they have been exposed, and therefore they are in fear for good reason. And the good reason is this. They are about to uh, vacate this planet and uh, willingly or unwillingly they are about to be excommunicated from this world. And uh, this is why they're in a bit of a turmoil. So, also, the, uh, uh, according to rumors, and uh, of course rumors have a tendency to be based on fact as well, uh, restoration of the Republic of the United States to begin on Sunday at midnight. It is, that is what is in the divine plan, so we will, shall see what occurs. And uh, let us see here. And a good, another bit of information is once the, what you call the uh, the transition begins on, on the Earth. Earth Alliance will no longer have use or need to use your RV as leverage for negotiations because it will be long past, it will be passed and they cannot use it anymore. So, that is some, a bit of uplifting information for you. And uh, if, without further ado, those of you who have, have wanted to ask questions that were unable to do so uh, due to time limitations, we have this, this call today is for you, for you to ask. I, 
Praise yes, God. so I will go, yes, I'll go ahead and at least begin with some of the questions that I've received. So one question has to do, one, uh, with the exchanges or prior to the The stock, the stock market is going to go into a downward spiral. Uh, not uh, in a devastating way, but uh, to some people it will be devastating because of their, their investments and such. But it, it will go back on to the upswing after the... Uh, uh, Revaluation has occurred. So, there's nothing to fear. Uh, also, many people have, have been told of uh, cataclysms that were uh, been foretold. And uh, I want to put all of your minds to rest about one thing. These cataclysms that have been discussed and brought forth, it is giving you what you call um, a map or a, uh, uh, sort of like a timetable. Understand these events, these cataclysmic events, will not occur and you will not be experiencing it because you will not be here to experience it. The time for the upheavals and uh, seismic activity and uh, catastrophic flooding, uh, submersion of cities, and things of this nature is nothing for you to be concerned about because you won't be here to witness it. That will be the time of the gathering. Uh -huh. Understand, Earth must expand. And as she expands, of course, everything from 400 miles uh, upwards from the center of the, of, the, of, of the crust of the Earth, all of that will be in flux and in, in upheaval because of the planet's expansion. And uh, that is a natural occurrence because... Uh, Terra Christa must expand. It is in her. It is in her makeup. But you will not need to worry about it because you will be in ships. You will be in in hollow earth. You will be in what you call a safe haven. So do not worry about these doomsday sails and things of this nature, because it does not pertain to you. Go ahead. Since we're talking about cataclysms, I think people presently, uh, perhaps maybe you could just let us know. I mean, we're still going to have some earthquakes, correct? We'll probably still oh, have yes. some earthquakes minor, in the California minor, area. Minor quakes. Right. Minor quakes. Yes, and we'll yes. still, ha we'll still uh, have the, the hurricanes and tornadoes and stuff, like in yes, Florida. Of oh, yes. yes. Yes, okay, yes, yes. So those are, but those are not things that we we have to be that we have to be so concerned about that it's going to risk our lives. Is that correct? That is correct. Or Understand, hurricanes or or uh, Terra Christa's way of cleansing uh, areas where these storms are situated, and uh, your quakings are simply pressure releases that are being uh, opened by, or zippers they call them, uh, or what you call it, you, so you turn them as fault lines, but they are zippers, uh, to release pressure in the, uh, in the crusts of the earth. So uh, it is, you know, you're going to, people in California, you're going to have their tremors and things of this nature, but there's nothing of a major proportion. The major proportion or what you call, uh, what they've been determined, the big one, as they term it, uh, where it is supposed to uh, bring mass destruction to what you call the, the cities of the western coast and things of this nature, that is 
slated for another time. And that will be when uh, Terra Christa does her expansion. And as I said before, you won't be here to worry about it because you will be basking in what you term as the mm, the ecstasy of uh, being with your star brothers and sisters and with your hollow earthians and things of this nature. So you will, you will be too busy enjoying yourself to even worry about the surface of Terra Christa. And what about the fires, Sora, in California and Northwest? <clears throat> Some fires have been perpetrated by the cabal in, 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 a, in a, what you call a ditch effort to eliminate certain uh, uh, beings who have been bringing, uh, who have been exposing them, and uh, by way of what you term laser beams in the in the noses of aircraft, um, that was part of it, and uh, or much of it was also just Mother Nature doing her thing. Uh, and in, uh, in a couple instances, it was because of arson. But uh, do not concern yourself about this, because Terra Christa has it well in hand, and then she is quite capable of uh, uh, dealing with it. So are you saying that we're not, there still be, there there probably will still be fires, however, correct? Oh, yes, there will be fires. And in some cases, it's because they are what you call clearing land areas, uh, zones, you term them, as what you call emergence zones uh, throughout the United so States and throughout other parts of the world. Can I just clarify then that the fires are not going to will not be as devastating as they were this past year? No, they will not. Thank you for that. Another question that has come up, Zora, is in regards to martial law. Yes, martial law. I have I have heard about this, and uh, I can assure you. What is termed as martial law is a last resort uh, to a, uh, to a uh, situation. But understand, martial law takes away your freedom even more than you have right now, presently. And uh, that is something that uh, is not necessary. And, uh, of course, that will be dealt with and when the time comes. Um, but understand, uh, as we have said before, Terra Christa is slated for full ascension, and anyone upon her are slated for ascension as well, in their own, at their own time, uh, according to their contract. But understand that... Mm, um, Terra Christa herself has has already shifted uh, in her in her essence to full fifth dimension, and uh, the, the the guests that are upon her surface are simply uh, in the process of catching up, and uh, that's what you're doing. Uh, the more you awaken, the more you allow uh, Terra Christa her essence to come into your being, you will transform. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. You're